I heard they're arresting more of these street boys for loitering. Well, that's just the well nature things, I guess. Alright, so what's up guys and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Oh, okay. I know. It's been a long time again. Um yeah, your dead eye ability has improved. You will now remain in dead eye when you fire your weapon if you have not tagged the target. And the 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 <laughs> The concern is I don't know how to tag an enemy using the dead eye core. Now, let me just check the settings real quick. But anyway, as I was saying, it's been a long time, I know. Um, I said it as well on the last episode, back at episode twenty-four. So this is the twenty-five, uh, the twenty-fifth. I'm sorry, the twenty-fifth episode for Red Dead Redemption Two. Okay. Okay, so I saw it. Um, it's Q for us to tag. Okay, I'm sorry. I, I forgot the, the controls as well. But anyway, Hola. what do we have here? Okay, I think this will do it. Yes, yeah, Schofield. Dual wield, huh? Yo! Come on! Don't do that. Okay. Don't want the lawmen behind us again. Okay. Anyway, or on us again. So we've got more stuff for the strangers. Okay, that's the thing. Okay, and as I was saying, I'm just, I'm back in the game since my schedule in work is not that tight anymore. So we have more time for this. I focused on The Last of Us Part 2. So hopefully you guys are also watching my gameplay of this game. Or of that game, I mean. And I'm thinking of going back to GTA 5 LSPDFR at least for once. You know, once a month. I really missed that game. So, um, tell you the truth, that's the one game in this channel that gets like 500 views per video okay so yeah a lot of people watch my videos for gta 5 lspdfr so i'm thinking of going back to that one sometime soon right sometime soon i th I, I want to try out nypd again but anyway yeah we're not gonna talk about that let's go back here to Brother Dorkins. Okay. We're in RDR2 for Christ's sake. Okay. First lady. Oh, I missed lady, bro. I missed lady. Where where is she? Okay. So we can use Dead Eye Core and then press Q to tag enemies. Okay. That's noted. Let's go, girl. Hello. Out of the way. Hey, why is this happening? I don't know. You tell me. You tell me. Okay. So maybe we'll focus more on the strangers on this one. On this episode. And just have one main mission with Dutch. Okay. Yeah, bro. I missed this game. Okay. Yeah. Better Dorkins. Oh, it's the people we help, right? I don't know. Hello, mm. mister. Sister, my friend, Mr. Morgan. Oh, all right. Oh, sir. Brother Dorkings told me about the wonderful thing you did. Oh, Help he those talks a lot oh, of no, no, no. Spanish. No offense. None taken. None taken at all. What? Hey, stop. He's kids that'll work. Don't hurt him, please. Meet us at the cathedral, Mr. Morgan. Where's that kid? Goddamn kid. Really? That fast? You. Yeah. Alright. You alright? Oh, how Leo. Kid did this? Hey, you know him? He robbed me. Which way you go? Uh, that way. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Right, goddamn kid. No. Oh, Get what happened? Me. Where's my watch, you little weasel? I don't know nothing about Hey, you. Why don't you leave the boy alone? What's it to do with you? I can hit a lot harder than you. Hmm. I promise you that. Alright, forget it. Little shit ain't even worth my time. Why'd you do it? Thanks, mister. Oh, the crucifix. Alright. <clears throat> oh, we're looking good. Hey, you want some company, mister? No. Nope. You sure? Hey. What? I don't know you. This is. Downs? Oh, no. Yeah. Thank you. 
Get away. Ah, now. I mean, I, hey, Help. Uh, Help! Hold on! This man is bothering me! What? No, Someone bro. Help me. Officer, help! This one. That's Mrs. Downs. Oh, shoot. Escape the law, huh? Really? Come on, bro. I helped you. God dang it. I mean, not really. I helped the kid. Yeah, did I deserve this? That's Mrs. Downs. Yeah, you guys remember Thomas Downs? Is that one mission with Thomas Downs? It's been a long time. Maybe you guys can't even remember that about that one. But somebody owed us, you know, at least uh, Herr Strauss some money. And Thomas Downs was the one who died. Why did I even run? Why did Why did I just not call Lady? Come on, lady. Alright. Without alerting the law? Okay. So we have to keep an eye out for lawmen. Come here, lady. Wow, you can open gates? Nice! <laughs> anyway. Hello. Hey, mister. Oh my god, I miss playing this game. I'll take it over, right? Well, all the best. So long. <laughs> some nice touch, you know, be able to talk to some strangers as well. You doing okay? Hi there, ma'am. <laughs> Hello. Trying to be polite. But anyway. Yeah. Thomas Downs. It's that guy who died. No? It's that guy who died. Um leaving Mrs. Downs alone with his son. Or, or I mean with their son. So Oh you no 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 that's a law man Oh oh shoot no, how about here? Let's just not look at them. Okay? Every day. There you go. I'll be back with you, lady, alright? Over time I learned to ask how instead of why. Often the picture. What? Mr. Morgan! Excuse me, father. Sister, I got your cross. <gasps> you didn't! Oh, I did. Oh, I hope the boy... He's fine, physically. Mentally, he's a piece of work, but who am I to say? Brother We're Dorcas so clean, was bro. right about you. You are the most wonderful man. Brother Dorkins is... Greatly deceived, I'm afraid, but I'm happy to help a little. <laughs> Thank you. You see, it's a thing, but... My mother gave it to me when I was a novice. Shortly okay. before she passed, you are the most wonderful. Sentimental man. value. Oh, excuse me, father. Sister. Enjoy your day. See, father? Oh, there's a lawman there. Don't go there. Come on. Brother Dorkins told him. Alright. I told you. You got bronze for that, huh? <laughs> anyway, let's go. Where do we go next? So that was quick. No? That was quick. What's this one? Another stranger. We've got one over here as well. Maybe we'll check this one first. Yeah. Clear out all the strangers. Okay. Stranger missions. Is, the is this a one way? Okay. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm gonna have to give something to Lady. Just give Parker. me a sec. Okay. It's been a long time, Lady. Really long it's time I missed you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Just a scratch, lady. Let's go. Can I help you? Nope. Maybe. I don't know. But anyway. Oh, there's a dog. That's cute. I'm sorry if my movement sometimes are quick. I don't know. Maybe that bothers you. Yeah. What's with this? The first oh, time I played. What? The first time I played the game, I did not do that much of stranger mission, so I'm doing it right now. Don't want to miss anything. Okay. So what's this one? What? <laughs> Listen, bit of a weird question, but do you know where I might find some moonshine? What? Moonshine. moonshine. No, strong liquor. Over strong. Wow, you want to get over drunk? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it's not for drinking. <laughs> 
Don't touch me. What right? is it for? Oh, I just need some. Well, as luck would have it, you are in the legal hooch capital of America. Ooh. There's plenty of real booze here. <laughs> but for shine, well, I'm guessing you'd need to go out into the woods. I mean, I know you'd have to go out into the woods. Well, listen, I don't need that much. How much? About a hundred gallons. A hundred yes, gallons? Why? Oh, all right, I'm trying. I'm building a machine. A machine of love. <laughs> hundred gallons of hooch and love's gonna come pretty cheap. <laughs> Please, friend. I'll pay. All right. Just, just, just bring it here. It's for a good cause. A good well, cause, huh? If anyone knows who's moving that kind of shine, it'll be that stagecoach guy in Rhodes. Okay, okay talk to Alden at Road Station. So we are headed there now. Roads. Oh, it's a long way, bro. Really? Alright. Then I guess we'll be doing that. But I'm just gonna go to the stagecoach. Alright. Yeah, why did I even mark it? If that's the case. I need a stagecoach. There you are. Oh, sorry. But anyway, that's a long way. Maybe I'll skip this part. My way towards... Uh, I mean, my way to this stagecoach. Yeah, I'm excited for 2023, guys. So, I'm planning on changing my graphics card next year. It's still a long way. It's still a long time. But yeah, that's my plan. Okay. An RTX 3060. So I'm gonna be selling my um, my graphics card right now. It's pay your bounty to use the stagecoach. Really? I have a bounty? Okay. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Sorry. Ladies. Don't worry, folks. Hello, <laughs> train is running slow today, but it will be here soon. Yeah. I see you there. Give me a minute, please. Good on you. Get a fresh start. Anime. Thank you. A 3060. Okay. Not the TI, not the Super. Evening. If there is a Super, but... Yeah, only the basic one. The base one. So, hey, in roads. 3060 or the 6600 XT. But, you know, at that price point, I would rather go for the RTX. At least try a fresh one or something else I mean just so we have the RTX on and DLSS you know. yeah. the prices are starting to get lower and lower that's why and I'm guessing by 2023 by 2023 the price will be all normal again so yeah Roads. Oh, it's been a long time since we've been here, and I've never experienced fog back here at Roads. So this is a first one for me, bro. Roads. That's known to be like a place where it's all dry. You know. I mean, look at the soil. It's all red. Oh, I forgot. I even forgot that. Um. Yeah, Alden is back here. Gonna hit you up real good, lady. What? Why'd you do that? Okay. It sounded like a good robot, evening. bro. Good evening as well. Okay, let's go to Alden. Good evening, sir. Good evening. Glad you dropped in. I've got that, uh information you asked for yeah the bounty um, i mean the the, the moonshine i'm sorry specific <laughs> this time a wagon full of moonshine well you might just be in luck yeah i knew i picked the right feather to speak to okay inspect the note all right let's do that um read it Bridge in Blue Water Marsh, north of Saint Denis. Bro, we'll be headed back to Saint Denis. Look for a wagon coming south. Should be carrying a load of moonshine bottles in the back. Drive careful with it. Okay. 
it might explode, right? Maybe. Since that's alcohol. So. Let's go. Let's go, lady. So we go there, alright? We've got another stranger there? Come on. So this one. Okay. Well then let's do that. It's a long way, I know. Uh, that's fine. Bro. Yep. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm just mesmerized with this. Look at that. I mean, of course, while I'm recording this, um, the resolution, I mean, the quality might like be lowered. No? Because of my encoder, it's not so nice. That's why I wanted to have an RTX card as well. Since they have the NVENC encoder and it's a good one. It's smooth, you know? But this one, not so good. The yeah. RX 5500 XT, so... Yeah. It's so good. And it's just that it's fresh for my eyes again after a long time since I've been playing The Last of Us Part 2 and I can only get like 30 frames per second. And on this one, it's more than 60. Okay? <laughs> That's why yeah. my eyes are enjoying every second of this why is that guy running yeah. why why are you running what happened hey there mister you you good wait up pal i ain't serious what went back okay that was weird anyway even get bother oh my god i forgot how beautiful this game is Whoa. Oh, what's happening here? Oh, shoot. Oh, they're shooting each other. Okay, so that's how we mark again Q. Okay. Return this wagon to a wagon fence for our reward. Alright. So they killed each other, huh? But yeah, I got one. I mean two of them. Gun oil, so we need that as well. We need the gun oil. Should we do it for a reward? A wagon fence? I mean, uh, and the nearest wagon fence is all the way back at Emerald Ranch, right? What's the name again of the guy? Can't remember. We are back here. Emerald Ranch. Should we do it? I don't know. Yeah, why not? But let's check the the loot box first at the chest. Serves him right. <laughs> Ooh. Money clip. All right. Fourteen. I'll take that. Gold packet watch. We're full with it. Nah. Nah, that'll give us like a few bucks, but nope. I'm fine. Okay, then, We're good. Girl. Just gonna go for the yeah. the moonshine. Okay. We'll go for the moonshine. Come back to me. Come back to me. What the hell? Easy now. This is creepy as hell. Come home. What the hell? Where is she? I can't even see her, bro. There we go. Where's that lady speaking? <coughs> Come back to me. Hey, girl, oh, there's a crocodile. Okay. <laughs> what the hell? Bro, what? Was that a ghost? Was that a ghost? Was that a ghost, bro? Was that a ghost? God damn! 
You heard that, guys, right? There was even subtitles. There were subtitles. But where was the lady? Where is the lady? Come on, bro. You have to show me her face. I'm not kidding. I heard it right. God damn, bro. Is that a ghost? I don't even have to ki kill the crocodile. Let's just Come get on. out of this place. I'm scared. What was this? Oh, gator eggs. Okay. Gonna take one of those. Or all of it. Okay, all of it. Fine goods like these are of interest to collectors. Okay. Well, let's get out of this yeah. place, bro. God damn it. That was a ghost. Jeez. Whoa. That was a ghost. Okay. Okay, we are in the clear. Alright, that's nice. Not in the woods anymore. Okay, so they will be crossing the bridge. Alright. Where's this shine? I don't know. We wait for it. Oh, that's the wagon. Alright. Let's go to the left. What do we got here? I'll be getting so this. All right. Oh, that's nice. Okay. Oh, what happened? That was nice, bro. Alright. Yeah, I'll be stealing the wagon. Just give me a sec. I'm gonna be looting these guys up. That'll be best for when we use we are using a revolver. Yeah, for sure. Like, close combat. Yeah. The dead eye system. Where we can kill as many as we want. Yep. Of course. Yeah. At least until the the core runs out. So. Whoa. Will be okay, lady. Yeah, all, right. all right, let's go. Get you on. Yeah. Lady, follow me. Okay, I can't believe we did this really at this time, huh? At this hour. Oh, we have to drive slowly, right? Is, is this gonna explode? I don't know. No, it's not. No, it's not. Well, maybe if we shoot it. <laughs> well, not really. Yeah. Oh. Alright, I'm sorry. Where is Lady? Lady is so slow. Well, of course, two horses versus one. And the train is... Yeah, so loud. Almost morning. I think we're actually near it now. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm only using a mini map. Smallest, the smallest radar. 
You're a wonderful man. Wonderful. I think you have to hide it. Yeah, my money. It's, it's for a very good cause. Uh, my name is Professor Andrew Bell the Third. Perhaps you've heard of me. No. Nope. Can't say that I have. <laughs> oh, I'm an inventor. Uh, maybe you've read about me. No. Nope. Uh, I don't read much. Oh, hmm. oh, well, that's too bad. Oh, yes. <laughs> you got my money. <clears throat> oh, well, it, it is the most wonderful invention, friend. Oh, you, sir, have done a great deal. All deed. I've done is get some creep a lot of drink. <laughs> Creepers. Excellent. No nonsense. Now, you've helped me develop the most humane machine imaginable. A well, way I need to the money. Calmness I need the money. Troubled souls. A way to end the barbarity of a public hanging. Give oh, me the money. So, so humane. What are you talking about? <laughs> The electric chair. What? Oh. It's a chair full of electricity. It's quite fascinating. It calmly and peacefully dispatches the sinners uh, to face judgment. Yes, judgment. Yeah. Where is it? Well, uh, it's in my laboratory. The next thing I need is a, a demonstration, a public one. Oh. Huh. Uh, do you know the police chief? Hmm? As well as anyone. Oh, wonderful. I Perhaps do. Perhaps <laughs> you can encourage him to let me demonstrate the chair. It will help bring this town into the next century. Yes, could you Not do that? really. Hmm? Whoa, what happened to Lady, bro? <laughs> okay, that was weird. Right, well, I guess I don't, I'm not going to get the money right now. Huh? Okay. Excellent, excellent. Oh, all right. Did all of that for nothing. Anyway. Yeah, do we have something to eat? Um, yeah, let's have a cigarette. What? Are you done? Okay. Um, no. This one. I'm sorry. There you go. All right, and you get me my money, okay? I'm doing it for the money. Anyway, yeah, where is the police gonna be? I guess this one? Yep. It's the fourth mission, huh? Did not even realize. <laughs> it's the fourth one already? Well, yeah, first one, then second one was back at Rhodes. It's the third one when we got the, the moonshine, so this will be the fourth one, huh? Yeah, let's do it, okay? Let's do it just so we are in one track. Okay. But it's morning, we haven't even slept. But I guess out that's out of the table now. Alright, now we can see the sunrise. It's reddish. So we'll be meeting the police chief. We paid for the bounty, so we're all good. Can get inside the police station now. Stop right there and face the law. Oh, Scoot all right. Maybe we can help the lawman. He's having a hard time. Oh, he's no. all cornered. You ain't gonna walk out of this town alive. Come on, please. I didn't take much. Oh, shoot. You didn't have to do that, bro. Can we help the guy? Oh, bro. What happened? Looks like he's worse for wear. Okay, off you go then. What? No, really, what happened? I wonder if we can help the guy. Well, of course, we're gonna get a bounty for that. Bounty on our heads. So, we're, we're not gonna be checking that out. Yeah, but I wonder if we really can. Well, maybe if we're not so honorable. You know, I'm still thinking about the guy. It's like Hello? he doesn't have any choice. Hello? There's another stranger mission Open right up. there. <laughs> Come now. We have an appointment. Early Hello? in the morning, really? This early in the morning? An appointment? Maybe we'll check that one out later after this one. Welcome to our humble police house. Yeah. Hey, partner. Oh, what? What can I do for you? Okay. We're heading in. Chief. 
I'm representing the inventor of a humane execution machine. That's a humane machine. execution machine? An electric really? chair. And he, uh, he wants to demonstrate his invention here. Ah, I'm familiar with the man and his work. Tell you what, I'll give you a permit. But it's going to cost you $100 in fees. $100? Negotiate, okay. Hey, look. This will save you money in the long run, and uh, it'll save the condemned a whole lot of pain. <laughs> that remains to be seen. Yeah, rather than being but hanged, you know. I'll give you a permit for 50. Okay. Yeah. I mean, we don't have that much of a choice, right? But how is it more humane? Okay. Well, the price is fair. Here you go. And here, sir, is your permit. Appending the usual formalities, of course, such as uh, finding a suitable candidate for humane dispatchment. I'll tell that to the professor. Good luck. Okay. I really you did that. You must be huh? damn stupid if you think you can come back here. What? I didn't do anything with you. Anyway. Well, that was me thinking you was in a rush. Paid fifty for that, huh? So I guess that's the next thing that we'll be doing. Wow, we're so busy right now. <laughs> but yeah, really? More humane? Using an electric chair? Well, of course, that'll be the first one. So they don't know just yet. Excuse me. Yeah. Hey, do I know right you? away. Okay. Mr. Well, I believe we've met. We have. At that ghastly party. Oh, Evelyn Miller. Oh yeah, so, the party, Mr. the evening party. Arthur Morgan, One with the sometimes. fireworks. Uh, can I say something rude? Oh yeah, sure. the Redskins. Okay. The mayor thinks you robbed him. Well, uh, to be clear, he, he wasn't very upset about it. <laughs> we did, it. in fact. He rather liked you. Rob him. Okay. Do you? Uh, what? Well, I mean to say, uh, can you steal things? Is there a reason you're asking me to incriminate myself, Mr. Miller? <laughs> Well, I'm sorry. Have you met? This is Rain's Fall, a great chief, and his son, Eagle Flash. Yeah, we've Still, seen them. Yeah, we saw you in the wagon train crossing the river at Cumberland Falls. And at the party, you were upstairs. Okay. You have great powers of observation. As my people, if we are even a people anymore, we've fought hard. We've made yeah. peace treaties, and those treaties were broken. And we've been moved and punished and punished and moved. Really, sure. these people were and the natives we in America. Again. Clearly, contravening the peace treaty signed three years ago. This will lead to war. No, my son, it will not. We cannot fight another war. They have got stronger, and we have become far weaker, Mr. Morgan. Less in numbers. Oh, it's uh, bad business. It's to do with oil. Oh. I know it is. But I need the proof. I believe so there were some prospectors them. who were on their land a few months ago who have filed reports with Leviticus Cornwall and the state government claiming huge reserves of oil under their land. Leviticus Cornwall again. So you want me to try and steal it? Obviously they can't. <laughs> and mm. even more obviously I would be useless. <clears throat> Listen, I realize that it is a ridiculous request, but we're very desperate. Now, I'm not a do-gooder, Mr. Miller. Gentlemen, I'm very sorry for your predicament, but I'm a working man. I got problems of my own. We will pay you very handsomely, Mr. Morgan. How much? Guess what? How much? <laughs> I told you, they're all mercenaries. <laughs> <laughs> There's a price on my head in two states, my friend. Hmm. The government doesn't like me any more than it does you. Yeah. Like you, I've been running for as long as I can remember. And like you, my time here is nigh undone. Might as well get some money. We understand, and we will pay. Okay. Thank you. You meet my son in a couple of days near Citadel Rock, just west of the oil fields. Okay. We are very grateful for your help. Gentlemen, that appointment with the senator... We should head over there. It's a waste of our time. And his. Oh. We must try everything. Oh, look at the nose. Come along. It's becoming reddish because of the sunlight. Hello, Mr. Miller. The counselor wants to apologize. He can see you now. 
We've been waiting I don't know how long. Or next month, if you'd like to reschedule. Come. Perhaps the senator won't mind waiting. <clears throat> anyway. Actually, that's an important part of the story. Okay? Meet Eagle Flies near Cornwall, Kerosene, and Tar. But of course, we can do that next time. Since they're still inside this building. So there's no point going there now. Alright. So in that case... Yeah, I think we've had enough of stranger... Um... Stranger missions on this one. Okay, or maybe we can give the the permit to the professor now before having this one last mission with Dutch. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, let's do that. Let's go, lady. Hey. Okay. On your right. Oh, this is nice. Oh, I'm so excited with the RTX. I mean, it's still a long way. A long time ahead of us, so. I don't know. You answer that. Yeah, RTX 3060. Oh, sorry. Hey! Will you help a fella out? No, why not? What's happening with Lady? He, he just slides sometimes. Oh, we can steal money from the guy, really? Well, of course, we Listen, at least we have options. You have to take this. Oh, okay. That's real kind. I lost my money playing poker. We have an open mail at the post office. We'll, we'll check that out as well later before going back to Dutch. Mail. Maybe that's something important. Maybe from Mary. Oh, come on. I'm sorry. That's just weird. Okay. Alright. I'll be giving the permit now. Yeah, when was the le the first time we we played this game? Ah, hello, friend. Maybe we'll be hitting hello, one Professor, year Professor. before we finish the game. The third. That's it. That's fine. So, the chief says you can test out your machine, oh. pending the usual formalities. And what are they? Uh, finding a suitable uh, subject. Ah, funny you should mention. This fella here, he seems sturdy enough, and he's guilty as sin. Wilson J. McDaniels wanted for murder. Oh, guess what? We'll be getting that guy, huh? Immoral animal husbandry. What's that? The mind shudders. <laughs> Here, find him for me. Bro. And help me put him out of his misery. Huh. We'll be doing that now? Oh, bro. Okay. Oh, anytime we want to. Okay. I don't know, maybe. <laughs> Let me just check that real quick. Okay, ninety-five dollars. Why, this is all coming together wonderfully. Wilson McDaniels. Flip it. Of course, nothing is there. So nothing is on there. You shut up, okay? I want to listen to this guy? Morning. You must like living here. <laughs> All the best now. Nice talking to you, dude. Whoa, what happened? Alright. Yeah. He's a lucky man, this Mr. McDaniels. He'll have a place in the history books. Really? You're, you're thinking about that? I mean, we'll be killing the man. Although, he must probably are definitely deserve that so yeah oh Good hey. I am sorry I mean it's all my fault going all fast anyway something for a lady really in the middle oh, bro give me some space 
Okay, I'm sorry, where's the post office again? Yeah, over here. Okay. Alright, lady almost got hit. Okay. Almost got hit by the... That wagon. Stay away from that one. Some people are just... Stay away from me? Okay. Good morning to you. Good morning. Good morning. Be with you momentarily. Receive mail. May I help you? Oh, invitation from Mayor Lamo. Let's read that. Okay, May 1899. Monsieur Kilgore. Oh, Kilgore was our name, right? Yeah. At least uh, for mayor. It was lovely to make your acquaintance at the residence the other night. You meet so many people at these kinds of functions. It is hard to keep track. I did notice, however, that you were near my study when poor Pyrie what? had an accident and Sam Do you mind questions. shutting up? Especially if they come through to just pay off a bounty. Shut up, bro. Had an accident and some documents simply disappeared. Now, I have spent far too long in politics to make accusations wildly, but just long enough to know when I am owed a small favor. Perhaps your gung-ho uh, frontier spirit and my cold old world cynicism could work quite well together. Indulge me in a meeting at least. I ain't got a lot going for me in here Come the moment, to the so back let me know if you like of the mayoral residence any night you wish. Knock on the door and my assistant... Jean Mark or John Mark will let you in. I hope to see you soon. You're your best friend. Henry Lemoy. Okay. F you, dude. I was reading Thanks. something and you were. You're not stopping from. Watch speaking. yourself. Pardon. Okay. No. Next thing. Our next um destination would be back at Shady Bell for a mission with Dodge. Okay, this will be the the first main mission. No? First main mission for this episode. Bro, really? Okay. Well, yeah. Racial discrimination is still happening today. So. <laughs> oh, what's this? Oh, shoot. Oh, no. Murder, really? We have to stop the witnesses. F you, bro. We have I'm to stop the. To really yeah. Dislike this place. Oh shoot! Crime reported. Hey, first of all, when you need him. Come on. You stop right there. Oh no, Fire you hand. don't be. You damn fool! No. I am for you. Stop. Stop, you fool! Now. Stop! Don't yeah. report. I'll kill each and every one of you if I have to. Hmm. Well, I'll shut up. I ain't gonna stick my neck out for no one. All right. Thanks for your attention, folks. Devil in hell! <laughs> you, just go over you know what? Just go. <laughs> okay, it's nice that we, we stopped them. You know? They did not report me. So, yeah. Okay, got through here maybe. Yep, we can. All right, but I don't like the place. Just making sure. Yeah, I remember that ghost, bro. Really. I mean, I'm not even sure if that was a ghost, but 
We did not see anyone, bro. There's nobody there. No one. Bro. Okay. It's me, Damas. Mr. Morgan. John Marston. John Marston is the protagonist for RDR1. Okay there. This so this um game is like a prequel. I mean I've mentioned this before to you, so it's just that maybe some of you are new on this channel. So this is the twenty-fifth episode for RDR2, so I suggest that you you watch the first one. Okay. <laughs> Watch the first one. This story is incredible, really. Of course, for for my students who are maybe watching right now and you're new to the channel, so what's wrong, Mr. Pearson? Yeah, nothing. You watch the first one up oh, until this nothing. point. So twenty-five hours, well, then why do you look like a or th maybe Arthur. even thirty, since most of the time I, I get past the one-hour mark for an episode. Hey Sandy. How's it going, Sadie? A uh, Sadie, I'm What's sorry. His new haircut? You look like an accountant. <laughs> Bro, really? Ah, oh, shut up. <laughs> okay, I really like Sadie. No? Sadie's character in this game. I tell you what, little Miss Romance. I was right. Yeah. About what? Sandy. How so? It ain't romantic. It's evil. Oh, okay. So, Arthur, you get the deciding vote. About what? We take an insult and scurry off like cockroaches? Or deal with business the right way? We don't need to take revenge. We hardly know the guy. This ain't about revenge, Hosea. How Angela Bronte don't mean shit to me. Pursuits. This is about the fact we are planning to rob a bank in his town. A bank that he no doubt protects. A town where his men are gunning for us. Before we do that, we need to put him I out of commission. I disagree. There's always an easier way. There ain't no easier way. Now, We're going to be killing Angela type. Bronte. He is a vindictive little power broker who rules by fear. Now, we pull that stunt in his cesspit of a town. We're doomed. You want to leave this place? Leave this country? We need that money. Just don't feel good, Dutch. This is it. This is the last job that we are ever going to pull. Before the year is out, we are going to be, be the angle. harvesting mangoes in Tahiti. Oh. Tahiti, Farmers. still. But we need seed capital, and we need to leave. You know it. I know it. Forgive me if I can't think too much about the mango harvest. This is I'm... it. <laughs> Trust me. Or I don't know. If it's business, well, business is business. Yeah, we can see Jose. Angelo so Bronte stands between us and our future. You'll damn us all. Yeah. Arthur, come on. You better be right about this one. I am. I've heard that before, and usually I've been right. You should have listened to Jose. You say so. Quit doubting, Arthur. It does no favors. Come on. Why does it look like Jose? Like. What? Don't go into the light, Hosea, okay? Anyway. <laughs> yeah. Maybe you can move faster. Arthur, really? Can we just get this done? Yeah, I'm trying, but I'm walking so slow. A boat? We're headed to a settlement called Lagra. Lagra? I met a boatman there called Thomas who knows these waters like the back of his hand. That's how I open Why doors do we as well. Need a boat? So we can attack Bronte's mansion from the swamp. Oh, okay. Catch him off guard. He knows we survived the trolley station, so he'll be expecting some kind of reprisal. All right. Okay, makes sense. See, I do still possess some capacity for rational thought, Arthur. Maybe. Let's go. This is nice. Okay, follow me. I almost forgot how beautiful this game is. I've said it like a million times. Thank you. And I'll for say it again. For taking my side back there. It ain't about Easy. sides. Feels like Hosea's lost his spine. No, Hosea nice is just smart. Is it for the bank job or revenge for what happened at the trolley station? Both. Okay. Really? We need to hit that bank. 
And Bronte has the police and just about everything else in San Denis in his back pocket. He also said, Bro, us do you want me to shoot you? Unless we forget, took young Jack. I understand. We just got a lot of pots on the boil, giving all the folks oh, who's out bro. gunning for us. You all seem to have forgotten how money nice. is made and what it takes to support 20 people. Yeah. Let alone what it takes to give 20 people a new life overseas. With all due respect, Dutch, is this Tahiti plan really going to work out? You tell me, Arthur. Is it? I don't know. some goddamn faith. <laughs> I am bending over backwards to make a future for us. I know, but... But, 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 when did you become so small-minded? If you'd rather we break up the family, go our separate ways, just tell me. Of course not. This isn't a prison camp. I am not forcing anybody to stay. So either we're in this together, working together to get out together, or we're not. Calm down, there Dutch. simply isn't a reality in which we do nothing and get everything. I know. You're right. It just feels like we're on borrowed time again. I mean, the old Driscoll's found us. Yeah, we need to move, and soon. Haven't I made that clear? Anyway, here we are. Let me do the talking. Dutch is losing his mind. That's the first sign, you know. It's getting all desperate. Thomas. Maybe we should really like split up. Good to up. see you, my friend. Hello, Mr. Dutch. Thomas, have you met Arthur? Arthur? Thomas is quite the boatman. He's gonna help us get close to our prey. Yeah? The other night we had quite the adventure fishing for catfish. Now, my friend. Can I call in that favor? What do you need? You know Angelo Bronte. Hmm. Well, exactly. <laughs> We need to make a... That tells a lot. ...social call. We were hoping you could row us in quietly one evening around the back of his house. Well, if anyone can, I can. All we'll right. pay you for your trouble. If you bringing him trouble, it won't be no trouble for me. Good. My business partner, Jules, he's out on the skiff. I need to check with him. Plus, I need to check the traps. Would you come with me? Of course. Arthur? Why not? Shouldn't take too long if we can find it. Okay. He live. Mind you, there's a lot of gators. Uncommon number. Big ones. Great. Did he get to use oh, a gun? Now, Arthur? It'll take more than a prehistoric reptile to scare you, Shirley. Well, I just want to see you meet your match when it comes to a... An aging predator with a big mouth, Dutch. <laughs> Arthur here is something of a comedian, Thomas. More of a jester than a gunslinger. Well, if you say so, Mr. Dutch. This way. Come on, this way. Follow me here. Yeah, I am Stay following you. Stay on the high ground. You call this ground? It feels like water to me. <laughs> the swamps. Down here, we can't be too picky there, Mr. Arthur. The swamps. Got a couple of crayfish traps up ahead. Crayfish, okay. Oh, shoot. Mr. Dutch, you keep a lookout for company. Mr. Arthur, check the traps with me. I'm doing it. Are those fishes? Yeah. Nothing. This one's empty. Alright, I got a few more set over this way. Come on. I don't want to know what just touched my leg. <laughs> Mr. Dutch, you show you the right fellas to be going out to Angelo Brunson? Oh, he's much more the kind of reptile I can handle. Okay, now, this close. is scary as Make fuck, sure you bro. My line. Oh, I fully intend to, Thomas. You too, Mr. Arthur. All right. You can see why even in swamp waiting hasn't caught on as a pastime, can't you? I love it out here. He's Nobody bothering you now. Except really? Night folk sometimes. Night folk? The night folk? Yeah, some strange really? people around these bars. Quieter than the animals they are. 
Well, this just gets better and better. Aside from Crocs, huh? We've got some night folks. We've got some ghosts. Really, bro. And in GTA 5, we've got some aliens, right? Yeah. Anyway. I'm getting tired with all this shit. I mean, look at my stamina core. What? Stop where you are. It's a gator. Where? Just stay as still as oh, you can. Oh, shoot. They can see us, right? They can. What? Smell us? Why is it moving like that? Oh, it's swimming. Okay, we're in the clear, I think so. Alright, let's keep moving. I wonder if. I got another trap by that small moved. island up here. What will I happen? I don't know what's taking Jewel so long with that boat. I think we are all equally keen to find her. <laughs> yeah. We are all dirty right now. Oh, shoot, bro. That's a gator right there. It's looking at it, me. It's looking at me and it's moving towards me, I think so. Thomas, come on. What are we doing here? Shouldn't we just, shouldn't we just wait till, till it's morning? The hand here, Mr. Arthur. This trap is stuck in the mud. It happens. All right. On the other side. Come on, Arthur. Okay. Ooh. Oh. It's all broken. Guess something didn't want to be caught. My God. So it's true. What's what is true? It? There's been talk of a big old bull, but people talk a lot of nonsense. I guess this was. Big old bull? No, but only some huge could do this. Oh, no, I don't think so. Fantastic. Even that guy we saw back there. Let's hope it bites you first, Dutch. <laughs> Should we just keep moving? I don't really want to hang around here much longer. All right. <laughs> I suppose just can wait. Let's go. Well, you were teasing me earlier, bro. You are all scared as well. Oh, my back is killing me, really. I was recording The Last of Us Part 2 earlier and not even halfway. Hold up. My back all already hurts. Oh, shoot. We've got some more. Three of them? Okay. This mission is slow paced, oh God, really. No shortage of them. Good eating. Us or them? Exactly. Come on. Crayfish. What's a crayfish? I'm curious. Like, I want to take a look at really should have run into one. By now. I reckon we should split up so we can search both split sides. Split up? Okay. Arthur, really? You appear so at home here, you take the right. We'll go left. What? Just keep your eyes open. <laughs> really? Alone? F you, Dutch. F you. Okay. I don't mind. I mean, we have respawn, right? Okay, what's with the sound? What's happening, dude? Hey! Someone there? Hello? Really? Now, what if someone replies? Jules? And it's a lady again. Oh, shoot. What's this place? What's up there? Is that a man? Yeah, I think that's Jules. Hey! Someone there? Over this way! Oh yeah. That must be him. What are you doing up there? Oh gators, right? Most definitely. It's the big one that they're talking about. What what am I supposed to do? Hey! You in a tree! What are you doing? There's a monster. Oh shoot! A monster. Yeah. You okay up there? There's a monster. Where? Master, it nearly ate me. Hey, where'd he go? It's it's out there. Oh shoot! What? A big gator, biggest I ever saw, big and nasty. Knocked me off the boat and chased me over here. Where's the boat? You must be Jules. Yes. Where is the boat? Over there. I ran. I. 
No. Really? Okay. I'm doing this? Yeah. And uh, where'd this monster swim off to? Which way? I'm sorry. A I cannon, huh? Scaff. It's over here. And it's stuck. Stuck. It's stuck. Uh -huh. I'm sorry. Well, thanks uh -huh. for the help. I got it loose. Jump. Good man. All right. Let's get back to the dock. Yes, please. Let's go. Guess what? Here comes the gator, right? Gonna get Thomas? Okay. Gonna get Dutch? Alright. No. I forgot about this mission. Thank God. So, uh, who are these fellas, Thomas? Two new friends of mine. I'll explain later. Jules, we are very happy to have finally made your acquaintance. I thought I was gonna be out here all night. What you doing hiding up in the tree, boy? This gator was huge, Thomas. Twice as big as I ever seen. Twice as angry, too. Oh shit, Rebel I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I think we hit a tree so I'm sorry. Yeah, I thought we cleared. <laughs> we'll need to jump in and pull us free. Me? Okay. Yeah, just do it. Won't take you a minute, boy. Go on. This is a bad idea. Yeah, really. I think this guy is gonna die. We'll see any giant monster long before it gets anywhere near you. Got a couple of crack gunslingers here with the guns loaded. You'll be fine. You didn't see the thing. Yeah, hmm. neither did you. It's just a myth, Jules. Now pull. I don't think it's a myth. Pull. I mean, we're, we're three on a boat. And only one of them. I mean, I, only one guy. Oh! Jules? It's just him. He's trying to oh, pull us. No, I'm going in. No, no, we can't lose the boat. Go. <laughs> Go on, oh shoot. Oh man. Come on. Oh man. Okay, do a wheel. Oh my god, look at my gun. It's, it's golden. Trying. Nice right, over there. You good? I'm surprised. You're not eating I'm just coming. yet. I get you, son. Oh, he's bleeding out. You have to move. Maybe if you guys try and get near us. Oh shoot, bro! Right behind us. Right behind us. See which one. Shots just to pretend you care. I got <laughs> oh, Please hurry. oh my god. Right on my butt. Bro. Come near us, right? What are you guys doing? Oh shoot, I'm all tired. I'm all tired. I'm all tired. Oh my god. It's right on my butt. Come on. I am trying. I'm all tired, bro. Shoot the thing. No, no, no. I'm about to pass out. I'm about to pass out. I'm all tired. I'm all tired. Come on. Come on, quickly, quickly. Shoot, man. This should be okay. Get in. Okay, where's this guy? Dual wheel. Oh shoot. Okay, it's dead. Oh no, it's not. It's not. It's not, bro. Where'd he go? I think he's going. Shit, that is one big old gate. <laughs> oh, your boy doesn't look too good there. Here, take this. Try to stop the bleeding. Why the gator stop? Okay, is it dead? You're gonna be okay. 
Just thank your old Uncle Dutch. <laughs> I heard that. <laughs> We headed back now. I think so. Are we moving? There's still a lot of blood. You need to put pressure on it. I'm trying. That is one big gator. I stopped the blade. I think he's. I think he'll be okay yeah. if he don't get a fever. He's asleep now. We can bring down. Conscious. A fever is the least of our worries. Yep. Look who's back. Oh shoot. God damn. Do a wheel, bro. Can we use a dynamite? No, we can't, bro. Really? It's all gone now. Okay, I think it's had enough. Yeah. Jesus, can we get back now? I wonder if we can get that big old crop. You're gonna be okay, kid. Sorry, Jules. Guess all them stories was true. Big and bad. That's unusual. Yeah. Normally, the little one's angry. Big one's is lazy. Well, I guess he never outgrew his anger. Kinda reminds me of you, hmm. Arthur. You know, I don't think I've ever seen you squeal before, Dutch. <laughs> I weren't the one squeal. Yeah, well, oh, you, you were. were in the water with me. And this poor boy was nearly dinner. Can we get some help? Jules has been bitten. Oh my god. There's a monster out here. He's been bitten, but he's alive. Just keep him warm. Feed him garlic for the infection. Really? Garlic? Thank you. Both of you. I'm at your service anytime you need. Thank you, Thomas. Where can we find you? You just meet me back here. Very good. Can one of you help me put the boat back out? Sure. I'm gonna head back to camp and placate the irritable Miss O'Shea, who's causing more trouble. Oh, really? I'll come back the boys. Meet you back here, Arthur. Maybe help Mr. me first. Dutch. Old Bronte, bad man. I know. Kill some good folks. Hurt a lot of people. Well, he definitely lacks a certain charm. I'll see you soon. Be safe. All right. We got monsters out here. <laughs> well, we're done. Okay, we've got silver for that. I haven't gotten a gold for a long time now. But anyway, yeah. As much as I want to continue on playing this game, I think we're gonna have to cut this here. Okay, but anyway, yeah, thank you for being here, for watching yet another episode for RDR2. I know it's been a long time, but I promise you for the next month, or for the whole month of March, or maybe even up until April, We'll be having more of RDR2, especially that I have more time to play the game. As always, peace. I'll be seeing you on the next one. Goodbye.